be ready to go for tonight. Uh, we're going to warm up and then see what we have. How long have, how long ago did you progress out to shoot at the breeze? I had a few days to work on it, so that's why I'm saying like, you know, it's obviously like not ideal, but we're trying to get adjusted, see how it feels tonight. Um, we made some big progress the last days, and then just go from there. Yeah, how is the shot feeling? It feels good. How's the rest of you feeling physically? Because you obviously haven't been in any games in more than three years. I mean, I will, I will see tonight. That's always an adjustment. I think it's very hard to oh, yeah. simulate um, true basketball actions without playing. Um, without playing much, so we'll see tonight. But obviously, the only way to get back into shape is with How anxious are you just to get back out there? I'm sure it's been difficult, you know, watching, not being able to be a part of this. Yeah, but you know, like, um, one man down, next man up. We just, like, cheer for each other, and that's what we did the entire time. You know, now d life unfortunately, is out. So um, it's for me, I, I get back into the line of view, the same thing as everybody. Personally, I'm very excited to be back. Um, and and be out there, at least for one hour, and see how I feel. But um, it's always like very exciting. How did you simulate as close as you could to gain speed? Um, what was your best way to do that with your teammates at this time of the year, able to go with you five on five hard? Well, it's always like the same progress when you do rehab. You progress with like a little bit of uh, dummy defense, and then you go to one on ones, two on twos, and then you try to simulate a little bit of pickup basketball. Obviously, it's not like the same as game speed, but you get it these close to it. Your injury you was scary. Your injury was scary to watch. Uh, yeah. How was it? Like you're in the air and then you have no way of knowing how you're gonna land. Yeah, time definitely slows down when it happens and it, it hurt. So that's all I can say. What have you learned from being a spectator in this series specifically? That are some critical things you can bring to the table even if they're small. I think if we're connected and playing with the right energy. Even if other teams make their runs, we always have a chance just because we're so gifted with Luka and Kyrie offensively, who run the offense for us. Um, you know, the way that we play defense as of late has been like really, really good fun to watch. I don't think I've ever watched it on the maps before like that. So I think we have a chance at any given time of the game. Have you been surprised how you've been living by the rim with uh, the other You've been jumping at the bit. Yes and no. I think there's always like an expectation because they have big players too, but like I said, Luka and Kai are so dangerous in any position that they create so much space for everybody else, so um, you know, that's just the follow-up of them making big time shots. When you have heard you stay in the game to shoot the free throws, did you know that, hey, I can't, I'm not going to be able to? Well, at that point I didn't know, I just, you know, wanted to shoot the free throws in case it's not that bad and can come back, but obviously after going back on defense and trying to reach out my arm, I realized I can't move my arm anymore, so... If, if Derek hadn't gotten hurt, would this still be a possibility you play yeah, tonight? Yeah, yeah, we go by our schedule. I think we do a great job with the medical team, just getting ready and you know making the right steps. Um, so it would have been the same. Yeah. What does it mean after you as the next German after the announced situation, the conference final, and kind of? Overall, it's just a big accomplishment for the team itself to be where we are right now, you know, and after last year especially. Um, it's a lot more fun to win games and get far. Uh, it's, a, it's a special bond for the team, so I always like it. So. What's it like to read Luca and Kyrie and so play with it? Does that take time? Because it looks like you guys kind of hit your peak that way in terms of understanding what they're looking for in the space of it. Yeah, not just that. I think we also we had new adjustments during the season. We had some injury problems throughout the season, so I think it always takes time to get adjusted and fully understand where to be at. Um, I mean, they hit the peak right now at the right time, so we're just going to continue that. Thank you, guys.